Welcome back, Mentees. This is the Uncanny Omar from Near Mint Condition. And today's breaking news, I'm going to be talking about Conan the Barbarian, the original Marvel Years Omnibus Volume 3. Talk about the content and the two covers. So please stay tuned. And welcome back, Mentees. Uh, before I get started, I want to thank David Gabriel from Marvel Comics for letting me unleash the news about the third Omnibus. Um, so, Volume 2 is not out yet, but we already have a Volume 3 around the corner, and it's coming out in January of 2020. Uh, so, written mostly by Roy Thomas, penciled mostly by John Buscema, uh, Mike Plug, Howard Chaikin. Uh, there are two covers. We have the standard cover. The variant cover, as it's called. This is the cover that will go out to Amazon and Barnes and & Noble and all those other places. And this is drawn by Frank Cho. I kind of dig that cover. Unlike the big debacle over which cover should I get for the first Omnibus, I wanted the original Barry Windsor Smith cover. Uh, the DM cover, the direct market cover, which will go to places like In Stock Trades, Cheap Graphic Novels, Tales of Wonder, or your comic book stores, is drawn by Gil Kane, and that is the cover to issue 57. So both of these covers... Uh, will be available in January of 2020. Uh, so now let's talk about the content of the book. Uh, collecting Conan the Barbarian 52 through 83. Annuals 2 and 3. Powered Records 31. And Conan the Barbarian, The Crawler in the Mist. And then material from Foom. That's F dot O dot O dot M dot number 14. And the one thing I'm sure some of you, uh, what's going around in your head right now is why doesn't this collect the Marvel features six and seven? That's the Red Sonja stories that kind of cross over with Conan, the Barbarian 66 through 68. Um, I don't know, but that content was left out. Um, so I assume the stories can be read as is. It will be 824 pages and $125. Now, one thing I did learn from Marvel um, talking to them a little bit, is that they plan on doing the whole Conan thing as long as these books keep selling. Um, so that is really interesting that they're going to, they're, they're planning on going through the whole Conan collection and that's a lot of books and a lot of Savage Swords, but as long as people keep buying, they will keep putting them out, which I guess makes sense. Uh, so it looks like since this has started, we have three of these in about a year's time and also two so far of the Savage Sword. So let me know in the comments down below, are you going to be, be picking this up? Which cover are you going to go with? Are you going to go with the standard edition Frank Cho cover, which is actually really sweet? Or this original cover by Gil Kane? Um, I'd love to know who's buying and who's going to be passing up on it or where your stopping point will be in Conan. Uh, but again, coming 2020, January, Conan the Barbarian, the original Marvel Years Omnibus Volume 3. Um... Again, this was the Uncanny Omar. Thank you very much for watching. And remember, if it's classy and cool, it must be near mint.